and welcome back. Today I'm going to demonstrate how I make my delicious chicken parmesan pasta in the crock pot. I have some chicken tenderloins, but feel free just to use regular chicken breast. I just already had these thawed, so this is what we'll use today. We'll end up doing one tablespoon of each of these, except for the parsley. The parsley will be two tablespoons. So it's one tablespoon of basil, crushed rosemary, crushed red pepper, oregano leaves, and black pepper. And we'll do one tablespoon of parsley inside of the dish, and then we'll do one tablespoon of the parsley on top of the dish for garnish. And we have a large can of diced tomatoes. We have some penne noodles. I use about half the box. I have uh, fresh Parmesan here. I'll use about half of that. And then we'll use about half of this onion. The broccoli is optional. If you're not a broccoli person, feel free to just leave it off. I have to stress grating your own fresh Parmesan versus buying the bag Parmesan. I'm telling you, it definitely tastes more richer. I'm starting with a clean crock pot. Please rinse your chicken. And I have about five tenderloins here. Rosemary, parsley, basil, oregano, black pepper, red pepper flakes. If you don't like heat, feel free to leave it off. Onions. Diced tomatoes. And throw in about a half a cup of water. You can just use the can to do that. So let this cook for three hours on high heat and I'm going to shred the chicken at the bottom. Boil your noodles. Shredded Parmesan. So we've been cooking for three hours on high heat. Now it's time to slice the chicken at the bottom. Time to pour in the noodles. Pour in the broccoli. We'll give this a nice stir. Layer in the cheese. Layer in some more cheese. Top off with some more parsley. I'm putting this back on high heat for one hour and we should be done after that. 